So, you know, Picasso once said, art is never finished, it's only abandoned. What do you think of that? Um, I don't know if I really agree with this, but I think an artwork is done when it says what you want it to say. So you feel it. So how do you classify yourself, actually? I guess I'm the two, actually. I'm a painter and a photographer, and that's the way actually I wanted my work to be seen and received. You don't know if it's a painting, you don't know if it's a only a photograph. Art is uh, perceived in many, many ways as elitist, unfortunately, especially in new markets. Do you think art is a form of luxury today and it's only reserved for the ones who can afford a substantial collection? Um, yes, if you want to buy it, it definitely always has been the case that some elite in every country, they can afford to buy art. but. I th good thing also is that museum exists, so it is available for everyone to enjoy. A lot of artists today use modern technology. Do you think technology, modern technology, helps artists and do you think it helps you produce your work? You know, I do everything by hand. I still work with films. I, I um, print uh, in a dark room, I develop, I, I paint by hand. So the whole process for me is, is manual, but after all this, I, I kind of use the modern technology as you say, especially with the videos to achieve what I wanted visually. I travel a lot for my work and um, the series of self-portrait I started doing it when I left Egypt. First to be in Paris and then in New York. Um, in every city I know that I'm just visiting. I'm here for a few days and then I'm gonna leave again and I like to uh, sometimes document those moments in my work. When I ask you about money, power and fame, how do you rank them from the most important to the least important, in your opinion? I don't think an artist should seek any of the three of them. I mean, I started working for years and years before I even think that, is, that there is money in there. People are start asking me to buy my work and I was like, okay, why not, you know? And what about power and fame do you feel now as an artist? Because you've, you've uh, built your career in a very short period of time. And today you are considered, whether you like it or not, one of the top, top Arab artists in the world in the diaspora as well. So how do you consider yourself as a powerful artist? Do you have power and do you have fame? Um, do I really have to answer this question? 